So guys, this is Binance Futures and on Binance Futures, I want to show you how you can actually make a profit of $6,000 when you trade futures on Binance, right? Now, in case you don't know what futures is, that is what I want to teach you how to go about it. Now, futures is a form of arbitrage trading, but on Binance, it is called futures because it is a product on their platform, right? Now, arbitrage is a form of crypto trading that enables you to buy cryptocurrency at a low price, hold it over a period of time. When the price has increased, you sell it and then you make profit for yourself. Or you sell cryptocurrency at a high price. When the price is low, you buy it and make profit for yourself. That is what um, arbitrage is. And on Binance, it is called futures trading. Now, for you to get started, all you have to do is to sign up onto Binance using the link in the description box below. Once you sign up to Binance using the link in the description box below, you get verified on Binance by uploading the basic KYC document, which include the government issued identity card, international passport, driving license, and so on and so forth. Once you've done that, you fund your account. So on Binance, you have various means of funding your account depending on your country and your region. All you have to do is to choose the one that is appropriate for your country and your region and fund your account with it. So once you fund your account with it, the next thing you need to do is to come over to this future segment and you see where we have these two arrows so once you click on that two arrow what you're trying to do at this point is you're trying to transfer your funds from wherever they may be maybe from your spot wallet or your funding account into your futures account so once you successfully transfer it into your futures account you come to this point and then you will see up here that will have this particular cryptocurrency other usdt right so once you click on other usdt it will bring out multiple cryptocurrency or any cryptocurrency that appeared there it will bring out multiple cryptocurrency for you you can choose any one you want to go in with so you click on it and then you come and click on the chat icon of this particular cryptocurrency so once you click on the chat icon it will bring you to this point now at this point here all you have to do is select 1d so once you click on 1d what 1D means is that each of these candlesticks, they represent one day. That is, they open and they close in one day. They open and they close in one day, right? So, you will see here that we have two lines on the chart. The first is the purple line, which is the EMA8, and the second is the brown line, which is the EMA21. The logic behind it is that whenever EMA8 crosses the 21 to the downside, the market tends to go down, and all we have to do is look out for sell opportunity. But we don't just sell anyhow before we can sell we need to set these indicators on our chart so we'll come over to the setting segment so we'll come over to the setting segment and over here on the setting segment all we have to do is click on indicators so once we click on indicators we select the ema that is the exponential moving average so once we select the exponential moving average we'll select our ema8 and the ema 21 make sure you select your preferred colors also and then you click confirm so once we click confirm the next thing we need to do is that we'll come to the 15 minutes time frame and over here on the 15 minutes time frame since when we know we are selling all we have to do is look out for a bearish candle so i love to look out for a bearish candle that looks like hammer that is turned upside down so once you see hammer that is turned upside down next thing we need to do is to click on sell is to click on sell all right so once we click on sell it will bring us to this point and then we select our market order we input the amount of usdt so once we click on it then we can input the amount of usdt we want to go you can decide to choose going with 5000 usdt and then we'll come over to this point and then we set our take profit and our stop loss we can even click on the advanced settings so once we click on the advanced settings we'll click on sell so once we click on sell, we can set our take profit to be 100% return on investment and our stop loss to be 50% return on investment. And then we'll click confirm. And then we'll click confirm. And then we'll click on short. We'll click on short, right? So once we click on short, it will be in the trade. And once we hit our target, it will automatically close. And then once it hit our target, so it automatically close and I will be in profit. Pretty simple and pretty straightforward. So if you like this video, make sure to subscribe to this channel. Turn on notifications so that whenever we drop dressing video, you'll be the first person to see the video, like the video, around with it. See you in the next video. Peace.